CM. Let's movie. Hi there, everybody. Thanks for joining us for this week's edition of the TCM Import. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Tonight, from French director Eric Romare in 1969, it's My Night at Maud's. As the title suggests, this is the story of a young man who spends the night at a woman's apartment, Maud's apartment. She's a beautiful, free-thinking divorcee who also happens to be his best friend's lover. So when this young man and Maud end up at her place alone, they both have choices to make. This is the third installment in what are generally referred to as Eric Romare's Six Moral Tales, a series Romare began a half dozen years earlier. All six films tell the story of a man who's married, or at least somehow connected to one woman, but finds himself tempted by another. And although this was the third installment in the series, it was actually the fourth filmed. That's because the story here is set during the holiday season, and Romare wanted to actually shoot during the holidays. So because the lead actor, Jean-Louis Trintignant, wasn't available to shoot over Christmas, Romare decided rather than shoot it at another time or with another actor, he'd wait an entire year until the following December to make the film. And that's exactly what he did, shooting another movie in between but releasing this picture first. A writer by trade, Eric Romare had been making movies for several years, one of the founding figures in the French New Wave movement. Most of his contemporaries in the movement had already established themselves as successful directors. Until this point, Romare had been working mostly in TV. This was the movie that finally put him on the map and established Eric Romare as a serious filmmaker, both in France and around the world. From 1969, also featuring Francois Fabian, here is this week's TCM Import, My Night at Maud's. Thank you. 